First, let's answer a question. What skills should you have before taking this course? If you are a programmer with decent understanding of object-oriented programming principles and c -sharp, then you have all the skills needed to benefit from this course. What do I mean by decent understanding? Well, let's just say that if you understand what the following pieces of code are doing, and if you are able to code this without the need to search Stack Overflow first, then your C-sharp and object-oriented programming skills will do just fine. There are no prerequisites for .NET Core or Entity Framework or how to create an API. Since you are interested in this course, I assume you heard of these things and perhaps played around a little too. And that's all that is needed to take this course. So what will you learn? Well, you will learn how to program CRUD API using ASP.NET Core 2.2 and Entity Framework. Of course, APIs are a huge subject and so is .NET Core and so is Entity Framework. In this course, we will create a CRUD API, nothing more, nothing less. Do not expect to dive into security, database optimization, asynchronous processing or anything else like that. Just CRUD operations, pure and simple. We will work only with c -sharp language inside .NET Core. The project we use is a great starting point as it introduces several of the essential techniques and concepts, including often neglected CRUD operations on database tables with many-to-many -many relationships. But of course, this is not a deploy-ready project. Remember, this is a course and a practical tutorial. There are a lot of courses that will show you the way into one topic and then quickly move on to another topic. This is not one of those courses. My goal is to lead you step by step all the way through the new territory inside .NET Core and introduce you to new concepts and topics and help you learn them. And equally important is to help you understand and retain what you learned through practice and repetition. If you learn by combining explanation, coding alone and practicing the concepts, while still having the option to see the instructor coding the whole solution, then this course is definitely for you. So if you are ready to jump into a wonderful world of APIs and .NET Core, I welcome you and I will see you in the next video where I will show you the finished API you will be creating in this course.